kitchen. Today we are going to be making paneer bell peppers. This is a very interesting recipe. It is a beautiful, tasty, smooth, silky curry which is infused with pureed capsicum. Now it might sound a bit weird but it's worth it. It tastes absolutely amazing. And so guys, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you will be updated each time I post a new video. And without further ado, let's get cooking. following ingredients 1 cup of yellow bell peppers 1 cup of chopped tomatoes 1 cup of cubed paneer 1 half cup of finely chopped onions 1 4 teaspoon of turmeric powder 2 teaspoons of ginger garlic paste salt to taste 1 teaspoon of coriander powder 1 teaspoon of red chili powder 1 half teaspoon of garam masala 1 tablespoon of ghee 2 to 3 tablespoons of oil Two cardamom, one cinnamon, one bay leaf, and two pieces of cloves. First, we are going to start by heating up our pan. Get that nice and heated up. Let me guys, let me give you guys a better view. And we are going to add in the oil or the ghee. You can use anything. And to that we are going to add in the onions. And you are going to saute it very nicely. Make sure you saute it well. To this, now we are going to add in the ginger garlic paste. Saute that as well. And you will saute till the rawness goes away. Once our onions turn nice and brown, we are going to add in our pepper, our capsicum, or our bell peppers, and you're going to saute it for 2 to 3 minutes. We're going to add in some salt. And after sauteing it for 2 to 3 minutes, before adding the tomato, we are going to add in the spices. So, turmeric, red chili powder, coriander powder and give that a mix. And next we are going to add in our tomatoes. Give that a mix as well. Then we are going to add in some water, mix it well and then you are going to cover it with a little and let it cook for 10 minutes. Add in some salt and then let it cook for 10 minutes. So after 10 minutes you can see the tomato is cooked. So now let's blend it into a nice fine paste. Now in the same pan. So we have created all the flavors in this pan, so you're gonna use the same pan, you're not gonna wash it. In the same pan, you're gonna add in the ghee. And 
and to that ghee we are going to add in our bay leaf, our cardamom, our cloves and our cinnamon. Just saute it a bit. And then to that we are going to add in our puree. Give that a mix. And you want to cook this nicely. Add in some water. And cook it. And let it cook with the lid for 2 to 3 minutes. Once it comes to a boil, we are now going to add in our garam masala powder. Give it a mix and cover it up. After some time, you can see that the oil has come on top. So now we are going to add in our paneer pieces. This is approximately 200 grams of paneer. Give it a mix. After it has been simmering, we are going to now sprinkle in a handful of chopped coriander leaves. Mix it and our curry is done. Let's serve it up. So guys, this is our paneer bell peppers. This is a very easy recipe. Do try this recipe. Bye.